Up, up, up. There's the light from upstairs. Oh, that means we're not locked out. That bat! Oh. Damn it. Well, we're locked in. You motherfucker! Oh, I knew this was gonna happen. Stupid, stupid bee. You cut a hole in the floor. Yell? It's not gonna work. Mrs. Miranda! It didn't work. Well, this knob is really old and loose. Maybe I can, like, figure this out. I'll look around, too. Yeah, you go look around a whole bunch. Then now's your time to redeem yourself. Bat says. Now why? Why did a bat know bat? This bat says rules of it, nature. Yeah, on it. to me too. <laughs> if it's I not have, letting you bat it. If I had a bat, I'd name it rules of nature. It's one thing she could hear is the furnace. When it was broken, broken thing <laughs> needs to be broken. Maybe now's the bat's time. Just come on, come on, yeah! What's the one tool I do want to <laughs> use? A tool for beating ass! Yeah! Just call me Donnie Donowitz! <laughs> Holy shit! The Bear Jew! Ah, <laughs> oh, it's like you just beat up a Kirby boss. Fuck yeah! <laughs> Suck it, you piece of shit furnace! Wow, that is pretty loud. <laughs> I'm my own master now. Surprised I can't hear that back in town. Okay, Cole's <laughs> just coming, thank God. Thank me. Thank me, more like. Hey, Mrs. Miranda, you locked us in. I just beat Sundowner. <laughs> yeah. That was fun. Uh-huh. You all right? She gave us lemonade. Yeah. You, uh... You don't like lemonade? It's fantastic. What's up? Nothing, just tired. Worked all day. I'm all hyper. Good for you. You're zero fun. Yep. You need, like, some magical shit to, like, give you a new perspective. <laughs> Let me know when that happens. Wouldn't want to miss it. It's called drugs. B seems kind of straight edge aside from smoking. Yeah. She's all like, uh, alcohol and Which like, means uh, you're not uh, straight edge at all. Yeah. <laughs> you pick and choose what you want, huh? There you go. Just like religion. <laughs> Let's get up here. Why not? What you about? Maybe you can see another constellation. Not with my natural eyes. That's crazy. You have cat eyes. They're strong eyes. Maybe you can make a turn by jumping on the lower ones. I guess not. Fuck me. Ooh, fireflies. Can you not leave? Like, uh, no, I guess not. I can maybe go maybe you have to collect house. all the fireflies. Collect all the fireflies could be a thing. Could be a thing, yeah. I forgot who sang. There's a song called Fireflies. I think you're thinking of Firework. No. No, Fireflies. Definitely Fireflies. Okay. Um, no. Uh. <laughs> Are you like a firefly whisperer or something? They like me. That's... You're an interesting person, May Borowski. Um... Granddad <laughs> said being interesting is all you can well, hope to be. Well, mission complete. Woohoo! Now you have the fireflies. You know, I have to say this would have been a much less exciting evening if you weren't along for the ride. Yeah. I mean, you can certainly beat the shit out of a furnace. It had a boss life bar. <laughs> it did. You should, like, channel that aggression you always have into something useful. Dr. Hank said way back that I needed to repress it. That's a good doctor. Repress, not, like, learn to deal with it. He specifically <laughs> said repress. <laughs> oh, okay. Huh. I think Miss Miranda, uh, like, pulled her husband's guts out. Isn't that what you do with mummies? I don't know, man. Like, nose through the brain? I mean, you think you'd have the stomach for it? Nope. 
I probably took a lot of heart. Yep. Oh, she explained it to us. I get it, May. She really wrecked him. <laughs> okay, that probably stayed in place. That should stay where it belongs. I'm leaving. Hey, you gotta live her your life. Why, this is me gone. Hey, wait up. You're welcome back to town. You've got a lot of gall to say that. I'm calling the cops. <laughs> Nicely done. Hey, Dad. How's work? You know, better than the glass factory. Is it? I've mined, I've ran machines. But now I get to slice steaks and hawk salamis. I mean, it's easier on the back, that's for sure. But, like, do you like it? I like having a paycheck. <laughs> Paychecks, the sweetest meats of all. Amen to that. What'd you do tonight? Oh, you know, stuff. Whatever. Tired. I feel like it just did a day's work. You know, there are places you can get paid for work. Really, no. Yeah, they call it work. You kids with your slang. Slang you could pick up at work. Point made. <laughs> uh, what about those boxes? Can you, could you fucking move them? Uh, I'm thinking about it. Watch some TV, though. I'm going to squeeze out the daughter-father time. Every little bit of fucking... Garbo and Malloy. Gotta do the S-Link if you want to get the boxes. Oh! <laughs> With Max Steinberg. Ah, yes. You know, we like to get political here. Gotta do it. Gotta. <laughs> Gotta do it. You hear it. about this new law on the books? Law? Pirating a movie online. You know about that? I do. Punishable after 10 years in prison. Wow, and here I've been trying to get a win getting the hard way. He has, folks. Oh. Wonder if pirating a movie about first degree murder earns you more prison respect than what about grand larceny? Hey, Malloy, you know what I think about the law? What, Garbo? That's a Wopa! Coming up next, stupid sandwiches. <laughs> that those are the, the 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 next sequence in the talk show. Basically, animals that do stupid shit. We do stupid shit to animals. Jay Leno gets scared by something. Like cute or dangerous. You, you decide. decide. <laughs> Why not both? Oh, that was that was that was a that was a packed day. Yeah. So that that um. Up here, you say what's this? this is a poisonous tarantula? Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> my cars! <laughs> my motorcycles! Oh jeez! My chin! Did you hear about this? Did you hear about this? <laughs> you hear about this? There's a cat that ha that owns cats. <laughs> fucking beats things up. Does crimes? You hate about this? Uh. We got some messages. Uh, what's poppin'? Just crack a lot, kidding. Hey, that was fun. Let's do that again sometime. You are pretty handy when it comes to breaking stuff. Break stuff! Break stuff tonight! I'm sure there's a job in there somewhere. Yeah, it's called demolition. You can actually get a job doing that. Holy shit, I found my call. I'm glad I could help facilitate this. Oh, and I looked up people who attract insects. Seems to come down to a lot of heat and various odors. They can get it. They can't. They cannot. <laughs> My odors bring all the fireflies to the yard. yard. I guess not. Good night, May. <laughs> hey, punk, what'd you do tonight? Got trapped in a basement. Beat up a furnace. Right on, man. Night, night. There we go. Very good, very good. I never saw that basement sequence, by the way. Bedtime. That was new stuff. Oh, you did other stuff? Yeah. Cool. I forgot what I did, honestly. You probably hung out with. I uh, hung Greg's. out. I did a Greg thing, but I did a B thing too. But I think that's when I started a second. It's like, do you want to be the straight man, or you do? Do you want to be the wacky one? Yeah. That's basically what it's asking you. There's two wackies together. Oh, oh shit! More of these. Um, what the fuck was it called in Snake Eater? What do you mean? The Snake Eater dream. You mean the the guy? The thing? action game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that a name, Guy Savage. A guy, more Guy Savage sequences. I guess. I guess that's the closest thing. All right, more fat guy music. We're doing this again. Oh yeah. Yeah. 
go eat at A and W. Why is that funny? They literally have food called Chubby Burgers. So someone remind me of the Paunch Burger commercial from Parks and Rec. That uh, that uh, Master Miller. <laughs> Come get it, fatties. The soup Healthy food is for suckers. It tastes like garbage, and if you like it, you're stupid and a liar. Uh, Eat the paunch burger. Yeah. <laughs> is it good for you? Who cares? How many calories? Shut up. I still think the absolute best is that SNL sketch. Which? Uh, there's an where they we took your favorite super grease burger, deep fried it. In wrapped fat, it in, in a fat pizza. Batter, wrapped that pizza in a giant oversized taco. <laughs> deep fried the whole thing. Put it in a commemorative tote filled with salsa. <laughs> and like Andy Sandberg's yeah. like, oh shit. Yeah. yeah, we call it the fucking the Annihilator. <laughs> Come get yours today. No, the, 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 the thing, they wrap it in pizza and you're laughing. But to me, it's always... We then stuffed it into a commemorative tote. And they drop it. They literally drop it. Filled with Whoa, salsa. that's cool. Well, I mean, it's actually really basic. But yeah, no, but it's just neat. All right, and now. Uh, like, the like the earliest example of that type of funny commercial make fun of, like, American, like, mm -hmm. chains and stuff, to me, it's like, it's, it's really basic, but, like, it was early. It was the Simpsons one where... Uh, like we 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 put two four sizzling uh, strips of bacon on two patties, put in some fries and top it off with a fried egg. We call it the Good Morning Burger. Right. And Homer's just like, oh. Uh, but that's like 1992. Like yeah, that's yeah. fucking early. That was pre Double Down. Era. Yeah, it's pretty pre. Uh, uh, yeah, the Double Down sandwich or whatever, or the Baconator. Did you watch the Game Grumps video when Aaron went to the actual Wendy's, like, uh, kitchen? I did not. Dude, you need to see that they make some fucked up shit that he's all amazed. Wow. They make a Frosty burger. They put the Frosty inside the burger shit. That's a crime. It, it was awesome. He knows what's up. Because I watched my friend eat a triple down. I didn't even know that's a thing. I think that's a lie. It's not supposed you to filthy be. filthy liar. He made that up. He did it. Um, I believe you. So I guess we're getting the band back together. I it's guess so. Basically what we're sort of doing. I don't know. I've 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 long since like not really sure what these dream sequences like you know represent something in particular. Hey, that was worth it. It was. This this, you, this, this is what you're supposed to do. Yeah. Maybe a little bit more. Who who else we got? Squirrel God. It's an ikari. <laughs> This looks like where the um, when we break into the tra the the place where this the thing is. Yes. It's like the same same kind of debris. Boom 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 boom. That 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 the music's gonna be happening when I walk outside this office. Thanks. <laughs> Whatever happened to that A and W bear? He died due to eating the chubby burgers. I assume <laughs> <laughs> it's chubby chicken. Yeah, whatever. It's Papa Burgers and Mama Burgers. And... All right. Why don't you put the keys on the table? Watch you save the game. Let me just check my messages. Okay. Go check out the Richard Cheese um, Chop Suey cover. It's ah, like yes, of fantastic. course. Fantastic. Hey, got a call from Mrs. Miranda. Apparently, she's upset that we messed up her basement. Whatever. She didn't pay us to clean it up. I'm at work all day. Uh, just saying, if you want to say hello, I am here to be helloed at. Hey, boyo. I work all day. Very bored. Work sucks. Crap Falcon, more like it. When do I get to hang out with these guys? No, that's Angus, so he's away, so he I should know. be coming back today. And I think that's Germ Warfare underneath there, but I might be wrong. I never had that, that last message pop up. Can you uh, click it? Born to lose, country trash, proud drummer, skate and destroy, skate and create, bound for glory. There I think it's Jim Warfare. I, I don't know who it is. <laughs> Good job. I don't think you trust in my self-righteous suicide. I cry when, when angels deserve to bump it up, bump, 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 b
<laughs> Gotta save it. Hold the button. Hold the button. You're holding it. Maybe get out of here. Get out of this room. No, you saved here last time. Nope. Yeah, nothing will happen if you go on the stairs. It's the button that brings this up. Holding the button saves. Holding triangle saves, right? Yep. But there's Unless no it screen. automatically saved here because there's no other state for it to save in because it already saved. Save and quit to the title. We That's do it funny. manually. Like well, fuck it, we'll do it live. Okay. Do it live! We did it. Fucking thing sucks! Oh. I got fired. Alright. Yeah! What did I- what did, what did I do? We had a fucked up tree. Oh god. Yeah, we beat up that furnace. Right! Furnace beats. Who makes a mummy? You gotta do that. Um, and that old lady trapped us even though she said she wouldn't. Yeah. And that was all- But we all. killed her, so that's fine. Did we end up seeing her again? Or did we just kind of run out of there? She's buried. Okay. Well, that's great. Let's go hang out. Let's go hang out with all of the warriors. Moms. Hanging out with- Look! Oh. She looks bored. Is that bored or disapproving? We don't know yet. Speak speak up. She didn't ask to, to see you. <sighs> Very good. Morning, long night. Yeah. I want to work with B. Oh, are you gonna work there? No, Mom, I was just tagging along. <laughs> oh. Oh, I was, like, really useful. Mm-hmm. It was a new and exciting feeling you being know, useful. Mae, people can pay you. Mm-hmm. For... You okay? You, uh... Yeah, just okay? been doing some boring adult stuff, little, little May. Little May. Hey, I'm an adult now. May, baby. Adult stuff is not all that boring. What kind of adult stuff? I'm adult stuff. You're fucking not. <laughs> with my no shirt. <laughs> in the neck. She's wearing a shirt. Shirt says no. Oh, with her no shirt. Right, right, right. Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> Just like budget, bills, numbers. Oh, that's boring. That is, that's actually a boring adult. A lot of adulthood is numbers. <laughs> Stress. That's true. It's really, that's true. That sounds bad. I'm bad at numbers. <laughs> oh, oh, I remember that. Yes, yes. Quite, quite terrible you are. Okay, well, I'm heading out. Okay. Uh... Have a nice day. Uh. <laughs> <coughs> she, although she's still just reading the same book she always yeah. has in her hands. It's more and more like, you fuck that number bullshit. The Barrel Boys. <laughs> or whatever, that Barrel Boy thing. So see if there's anything on the mysterious right. Are those guys gone? I bet you they are they're here. Fucking not. Putting up that fog gate. Eventually they they produce lose, the sign of the king to They pass. lose their jobs. It's never gonna and happen. And then they're no longer allowed to work there. It's not gonna happen. Oh, I can play it. Don't touch the ground. You can, I think, on at least that screen. The floor is lava. Hey, there, Selmers. Selmers. Totally what's up, Selmers? S you know what's good? Off the top of my head? Uh, <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> uh... Yeah! Uh, not <laughs> bleeding on your seat in junior high is good? Uh... I was gonna say those fruit snack things! <laughs> we used to eat in grade school. God, I love fruit snacks yeah! back in the day, man. Those are really good. Yeah. Did that other thing happen to you, though? Nope. Want to hear a new poem? Sure. Sometimes I like fruit snacks. <laughs> Out by the train tracks. I knew that was going. Of course. Decent. <laughs> a juice box and headphones. I enter the juice zone. <laughs> Those are like all I want right now. Yeah, yeah. You made them sound so real. Taste the atomic dinos nice. Ooh. Blue clear, blue clear squeeze squeezer. The blue clear squeezer. That's that's, that's amazing. Thanks. I think, think Chazakaw's up there again. Yeah. Good. He's gonna fall right on the stoop one day. Hope so. I can see this. I can see the water tower from my back window. 
I seen a fire up there the other night. Wonder who was up there. Fire. Mysterious. Let's see, see, see if. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, I've, I know. Like um, a couple people did say, always talk to Selmers. Always go see Mr. Chazkov. Mm. And uh, unfortunately, someone else. Well, it's not supposed. It's just they're like only hang out with B or only hang out with um, Greg. Um, Greg. And I think that sucks. And I don't want to do that. If that's the best way to get some sort of outcome, I think that's bullshit. It, it, I no, want to know you don't get a different outcome, but you don't complete their quest their time, line because you don't have don't enough days. Do it. Well, because okay. you have to choose between friends. Yeah, I know, but not but not being able to ever vary it. Deviate is silly, and I just want to play the game. So, but it, you can't complete a quest line if you don't complete the quest line. Yeah. This is what that is. I get that, but if there's not enough days to own to ever do any more than just sticking with one friend forever. Like that's life, though. Yeah. Well, I'm. I'm, I'm what I, I would rather see more of what the game has to offer by hanging out with different people. Or you just so play it with your girlfriend. <laughs> you can always do that. You too. can always do that too. I mean, to me, that's not any different than a Telltale game. Or. But right now, for example, I don't want to. I don't know if that's even right advice or if it's just wrong advice. But like, I don't want to never hang out with B again, and I don't want to never hang out with Greg again. I want to hang out with both, depending on my mood. Sure, no, that totally makes sense, but we're playing a video game, so, like, it has to give you two, like, sort of paths to follow, and then if you want to do a second playthrough, you... It's a, I, I don't get it, because so this, is, this, is this is the exact same thing as, like, Life no, is Strange. No, so no, so far I've had the choice to do one or the other, so I'm just going to do that. Oh, you absolutely have that choice, but you don't complete, like, Greg's sort of friendship quest line if you skimp out on a day on him. And I know what you mean by saying, like, that sucks that I miss out on that, but to me that's not any different than befriending a certain character in, in, in a Telltale game or, or Life is Strange or something. You're gonna you're gonna miss stuff regardless. I, I guess I'm kind of just thinking about, like, then why is it a choice every day? Yeah. Why not, why not just say pick one and then stick with it, and that's the or, one you get for the game? Or, at the at the very least, May writes something down in a notebook saying, or she says uh, some throwaway line saying, you know, this, this, you will miss something, yeah, you know, just, in a weird Well, way. just because, like, if it's a new day, then it's like, you know, all right, let's see what's up. You know, and I kind of just go... Because the game is is not infinite like, days, it's like, yeah. it's a set amount of days until the plot really... So I might feel like swerving left up. instead of right for funsies. <sighs> and she poops a lot when she's anxious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, but you, you kind of know what that person's talking about? Yes, uh, when, when I, because I, I hung around exclusively with Greg... Cause just because I I, you like I Greg. just I just like Greg yeah. like I like B too but um, I got to a scene that was like my favorite scene in the game and people were like you can this only happens if you only if you hang were, out with were, Greg. Were only hanging out with Greg now it makes sense because I I could imagine why am I going through this scene because the conversation that's being had is is is, is related to the fact that I've been hanging out with Greg. Okay. Like it wouldn't happen any other way. Okay. The way it's written, like the character, the way the characters talk. So, I, I would like like to see bees, but like uh, Greg's Greg's was was pretty funny and very real. Like it's like this is a conversation that okay that people have had. But I mean, again, again, I guess you you do have to make that choice of who do you want exclusively want to go for the rest of the game because I think like since you've hung out with both, I think it lets you do that. But after that, you have to make a choice. You know. Okay. Well, maybe but I'll we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Yep. Up here on my roof. Yep. Come to hunt some dusk stars. Mm, yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, have a look. <laughs> happens again. My eyes. Why I would can, you do it again? I can tell how your throat's doing that, because my, my my throat can do that too, especially if I have like some goo in the back <laughs> of my throat. I know that sound. Uh, filter. Okay, good. So now it's just like, look for them. <laughs> scanning. 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 I think it yeah, shows the ones you already found, so you, you can find Enhance. which is uncharted part. <laughs> Found one, 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 found one. <laughs> See it? Let's have a look. It's 
Let's play with the ball. Sterling this year. How come they ain't ever... How come... How, who... Who are these B-tier... How come I've never heard of these guys? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> By the time they got to these rare stars, they ran out. They, they, the well-known missing legends were taken. This one, Sterling, is a tale of the world changing. Sterling Archer and leaving one behind. Yeah. These are all going to be huge bummers, aren't they? <laughs> that is not for me to say. It is a bad thing for the world to move on. I mean, this guy probably doesn't think so. Either way, one day, his king met the new sage, an astronomer, and she showed the king how the planets and the stars orbit the naked paladins and why. And then the king kicked Sterling out of his quarters. But as he had long told the king a different story about the stars. That sounds fair. Is there no responsibility to care for those whose labors, even one's universe, are suddenly replaced with a new one? Are they obsolete? No. What is to be done? I don't know. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, isn't there some other job the king could give him? That's fair. Like some, some sort of way where he doesn't have to be useful to the king <laughs> in order to survive? <laughs> it's one to ponder. <laughs> the stars, they make one think. Wow. Yeah, so yeah. I assume there's one more. I mean, you know, the entire concept of a kingdom and a hierarchy everyone ha is everyone to begin has begin with is something where one guy's in charge and determines that others. <laughs> oh yeah, that guy. That guy. He had it wrong. This is a straight jacket and like. In fact, there. Yeah. Well, as they implied, everyone has it rough. Which these are all gonna be bummers. Which one of these shitty situations are you? I feel like it's more in the center. I feel like. Maybe that's I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm going, going for like a scanning. Yeah, yeah, I can see you're going. You're going columns. Yeah. Seeing just what I hit. Because usually when you got all the there, area, it's not going to be too close to the others either, right? Like, it has to be somewhat spread out. I think like down just a bit, like that guy. There you go. Boom! <laughs> Shakalaka. <laughs> Found one. Let's see. Yeah. I'm like holding a rifle? <laughs> oh, yes, Simone the fighter. She got a gun. <laughs> Simone lived in a good land, but under every good land are the roots of oppression. And in this land, those roots took hold and choked out all else. Jeez. Jeez is like whatever, whatever more. Uh, she says it a lot. Happens faster than one can imagine. I'm hearing Juno in my head. Anyway, when the borders closed and the curfew began, Simone and her comrades began to plot. They infiltrated, they sabotaged, they freed prisoners. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. Simone was one of the first to be identified. But she evaded capture even as the wanted posters went up. She should have ripped them down like Ezio, as whispers of her grew throughout the land. While more of her neighbors played in the night, that Simone would be their salvation. That's a lot of pressure for one Simone. <laughs> she was not alone, of course, that one Simone. She was what one part of a growing organism. But she became a symbol. A revolution. Big boss is difficult to think of many <laughs> things. Doyadova, so sometimes having a symbol for all of them is important. Like numbers. We do not know where Simone is buried. Ah, goddammit, I knew this wasn't <laughs> going to be happy. I mean, it sounded happy for a bit. We do know that when things boil over, she led a charge against the palace gates. And behind those gates were cannons. Oh, no. <laughs> many years later, when the mass graves were exhumed, her bones were mixed with so many others that it made some type of goro. It was said that she now lives on in the bones of all her country. That's fucking sick. That got dark and sad and spooky. That's sick, man. <laughs> that is history. 
That's both of them for today. You've completed the work assignment. Neato. That's a, that's the sickest thing I've heard in a while. I haven't found that. I didn't find that constellation. Her bones. God. Living on in her entire country. Wow. That was pretty great. 